In this video, I will show you how to create your first Angular application. So first we need to check that node is installed. We can open the command prompt or Windows PowerShell. And here let's type node hyphen hyphen version. So here we can see that the node is installed and this is the version that I have. If node is not installed, then we need to download it and to install it. So here we can type node. Let's go to the first link. Then we need to download and install Node.js. Now let's go to the documentation website of Angular. So here we can type Angular. Let's go to the first link. Then Docs. Then Getting Started. Then Setup. Then we need to follow this page. So now let's create a new application using VS Code. So let's create a new folder. Let's create it in the documents folder. So here I already created this folder. Let's open it. And here let's create a new folder. We can call it first app, for example. Then let's open the terminal. Let's go back to the documentation website of Angular. So first we need to install Node.js. Then we need to install Angular, so we can use this command. Let's copy it and let's paste it here. Let's press Enter. And now Angular is installed correctly, so we need this command only if Angular is not installed. And if we are using Windows, then we need also to execute this command. Now we need to create a new application. So we need to use this command ng-new, then the name of the application. In our case, we already created this folder, which is the name of our application. So let's go to the previous folder. So we can type cd, then dot dot. Then we can type ng, then new, then the name of the application, which is first app. Let's press enter. Let's press enter to use CSS. Then let's press enter to select no for SSR. Now the application is created successfully after about two minutes. So to run the application, we need first to go to the folder of the application. Then we can use this command. So here hyphen hyphen open means that we will open the browser. So we can either use uh, this parameter or we can use this shortcut. So let's copy this command. Then let's go to the folder of this application. So let's type cd then first app. Then let's paste the command. Let's press enter. And we obtain this application. So now I will show you how to change the content of this page. So let's go to the source folder and let's open index.html. And our application is displayed inside this element. So let's go to the content that is displayed here. Let's go to the app folder. And here we have the app component. So let's open this HTML file. Let's delete all of this code. And you can write a simple h1 element. And let's save the file. And we obtain this text.